guys welcome back to another vlog today is friday i am starting off a weekend vlog i haven't done this in a minute y'all work was a whole lot a whole lot of i had started filming a like work week vlog that i'll be finishing on monday but today is friday i wanted to just open up the vlog because my sister and my niece corey are coming over this evening and then i'll be going over their house for the weekend and then we're going to the apple orchard tomorrow so i just wanted to start off the vlog today i just dropped off charlie at my mom's house she's watching him for the weekend which I'm so grateful for and I'm about to go pick up food from bar taco if y'all have not been to bar taco honey if you ever go you have to try the plantain y'all their plantain with the dipping sauce is a one it is so good and I always get the pork belly rice bowl my sister likes the sesame I think it's a sesame ribeye rice bowl y'all their food is so good so I placed the order for pickup so I'm gonna go pick that up head back to the house and I need to film my um budget video as well when I get back so I'll be doing that I did my nails earlier today so here's how they look I've had this set on before these are the set that I got from kiss so these are just a cute simple nail by the way I did update my Etsy shop so I will link that down below if you guys are not familiar I do have budgeting videos that I do once a month and I am doing a Christmas savings challenge for both $500 and $250 uh, $500 and $250 so even if you guys don't watch my budgeting videos if you want to participate in the challenge click the Etsy shop link down below and you can download the worksheet it's only like a dollar fifty per worksheet if you guys want to participate and start saving for Christmas I know it's a little late to start saving I should have done it earlier but it just popped in my mind and it's just a quick eight week savings challenge so definitely check that out but yeah you guys let me go ahead and get over there and pick up the food before it gets too late and I will talk to y'all in a minute. Dunkin Donuts getting some iced coffee before we head to the Apple Orchard we're pretty much there we're about 30 minutes away so we're almost there if y'all have been following my channel for a minute y'all know we went to the same Apple Orchard last year and it is a vibe y'all so if y'all are wanting to go to an Apple Orchard you should go to the one it's called BJ Reese Apple Orchard in LJ Georgia it's a drive it's like that's the thing <laughs> It's about an hour it and 40 minute. I don't see it. It's about an hour and 40 minute drive. So it's a drive. <laughs> but it's worth it. No, Hannah, it's better. It's better? Yes. Okay. It, no, I mean, it's not that bad. Oh, yeah, but see, I want to go to the I mean, it's, I mean it is bitter, it. but I feel like what they going to put in it to fix it. Change a new one? Oh, that's bitter. Hannah, it's like drinkable bitter. I thought it looked a little dark. I said extra cream, three, three, and three. I mean, extra cream, yeah, it smells like it's gonna be bitter. Yeah. I mean, it's not, it's just the coffee taste. It's, I don't know. I mean, it's just, it's not bad, I mean, but it's not. I'm gonna get another one, <laughs> but I don't have time. Oh, Hannah. Should we? It's the last mm, one. I just feel like it's not worth going back and lying to fix. But like, it's drinkable. But it's not hitting. It's like the first sip is like, okay. Yeah, it's and strong. Then the coffee hits. No, strong. the first sip to me was too strong. This is doing okay. No, we don't play about our DD. Like, it has to be right. You keep swerving this thing. Camera. Yeah, we don't play about our DD, y'all. It has to be right. I think I'm gonna start asking for like yeah, specifics. Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to start asking for a specific amount. That's why I say like say three creams, cream, three yeah. sugars. Extra cream, extra sugar. Oh, I forgot to say extra. Yeah. See, that's why I'm like that. Oh, <laughs> but yeah, y'all. 
we are on our way <laughs> to the to the apple orchard so it should be fun it's gloomy and cloudy today so i don't know what's gonna be looking like when we get there and plus we're here a lot i know sir plus we're here a lot later than we expect it to be so it might be a little crowded but i hope not so we'll see y'all but i just wanted to catch y'all up on what we're doing today and then after we go to the apple orchard we're gonna go to home goods the home goods up here ma'am the home goods up here is like no other the last time we went last year y'all they had an overflow and the lady that worked there was saying that they were having another truck come in to deliver more stuff so i'm hoping that it'll be the same vibe this year because they had it was like the ultimate home goods experience so we'll see what they have this time around but yeah y'all i will check in with y'all later Your girl is hot, okay? The only reason I'm wearing this long sleeve is so we can take cute pictures. But honey, <laughs> as soon as we get in the car, I am changing into my t-shirt. I hope we can find some apples because it's slim pickings out here, y'all. Y'all, they ain't have no apples out here. Look, all the trees, y'all, empty. I can't believe it. Of the apple orchard we're about to head into home goods i hope that they have a lot of stuff to choose from this time like they did last time so we'll see what they have y'all Y'all know I love to cook. I love anything kitchen related. And her kitchen is that girl. Her kitchen is the kitchen. So I have to show y'all. I hope she will let me show y'all. <laughs> so I have to show y'all. But today is Sunday. Um, I am y'all. I did not get any sleep last night. Like I'm the type of person I have to have the AC on like 60. Okay, like I cannot sleep if it's like. 68, 70, 72, no ma'am, like, it has to be ice cold because um, I need to be able to like cuddle up in the covers and get cozy under the covers and I'm very like hot natured, I get hot very easily, so your girl was just hot last night. Um, yeah, she tips. Okay. Um, so yeah, your girl was hot last night, but of course you can't be telling people, um, can you turn your ear down? <laughs> so I just had to deal with it. But I am getting ready. We're about to go to TJ Maxx. She wanted me to take, she wanted to take me to the one over here. So 
We're gonna go over here and see what they have and go to the grocery store as well because I need to pick up a few things for uh, food this week. Um, so yeah, y'all, that's what our plan is. We did go to the apple orchard yesterday, but y'all, they didn't have any apples. Like all of the apples were picked over and the girl was saying, um, they had like, I guess like a, because of the weather earlier this year in April, they lost a lot of their crop. So that's why they didn't have a lot of apples um, left on the trees this year. So, but it was still a nice experience. So I would definitely recommend that y'all go if y'all have not been. Um, it's called BJ Reese Apple Orchard. So um, yeah, that was definitely a bop. And later on today, we're gonna fix some apple turnovers with the apples that we got. So yeah, just a really chill fall weekend. I just wanted to bring y'all along with me. Y'all, I forgot my um, I forgot my bonnet, so my hair was a mess when I woke up this morning. And Charlie, my mom just came over to drop off Charlie, so he is back. I don't know if y'all know, but my sister also has a Boston Terrier. Her name is Lily. I have to show y'all her. She is so freaking cute. Her tongue sticks out on the side. <laughs> she is so cute. And that's his sister. That's Charlie's sister. So they get along really good. But yeah, y'all, I did um, get back on Instagram. Y'all know, like, I have not been on Instagram in a hot minute. But I'm back on there. So I'll be posting stories. So definitely follow me on Instagram if you guys want to. Um, I don't be doing nothing, y'all. But if y'all want to, I guess, stay up to date with me. Follow me on the gram because I will be back um, posting stories on there and just trying to stay active and engage with y'all because I woke up this morning, responded to messages from like three weeks ago. And that's the thing too, y'all, like if I don't respond to you, like, you know, it's not purposely done. I just literally have not seen the message yet. So just give me some time. Give me some time. But yeah, let me go ahead and finish getting ready and I'll um, talk to y'all in a minute. All right, y'all, we made it to TJ Maxx. So I guess this is like a good one. I don't know what you're first of all. So we're going to go to TJ Maxx. See what they have, y'all. We don't need to be spending no more money because I spent some I money yesterday. She said she did. But yeah, I spent too much money yesterday, okay? But I want to look for Christmas items. That's what I'm looking for. The home goods we went to yesterday, they had some Christmas stuff out, but it wasn't anything worth buying. So we're going to go here and see what they have. And then we're going to stop by Publix and get some groceries because I need to get some groceries for the week. And that's about it. And then I'm going to head home and get ready for the work week. Y'all, how cute is this bag? Yeah, it's only $60. I mean, this is a nice duffel bag. It's like, yeah, s and &M. That's cute. You have it in white, too. Oh, apple turnover. That's what it looks like. Mm, no. Mm, I like it, 
but I feel like we do need to take the extra step to make the dough. I feel like mm -hmm. it's like pressing, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I feel like the dough. I mean, it's the 20 minute turnover. True. But no, they have Pillsbury like dough, you know what I'm saying? Like uh, pie, pie yeah, pie crust. Uh, Something like that. The flavor is on point. The, the Yeah, the filling is on point. But the filling will keep the filling. Mm hmm. This dough. Yeah. It's good. Y'all, I am exhausted. I'm about to head down the dusty road. I have about an hour drive to get back home. And I am to clean and get ready for work tomorrow. So when I get home, I'll do a haul of all the stuff that I got from TJ Maxx and Home Goods yesterday. Y'all, I got so <laughs> I got so much stuff. See, that's why I need to stop shopping with you. Because my okay. sister, yes, with you. Because my sister always be like pointing out the cutest stuff. Y'all, I never buy clothes in store. And I didn't even know TJ Maxx had plus size. Y'all, I got like five tops, maybe five or six tops and two pair of pajamas, y'all. I did, I was doing the most, okay? But I was like, you know, my birthday just passed. I have extra money for my birthday. So that's what I was, I was spending my birthday money, y'all. That's what that was, okay? But yeah, when I get home, I'll do a little haul of what I got. But yeah, y'all, let me go ahead and finish eating this and I'll check in with y'all when I get home. I made it home. I am finally home showered comfy so i'm gonna do a quick haul well it's not gonna be a quick haul but i'm gonna do a haul of the stuff that i got this weekend this is like a birthday splurge haul okay but let me show you guys what i picked up so y'all i could not leave i could not leave the store without this piece now my sister and i we both love steve madden bags like that's our jam we've been wearing them for years so when i saw this first of all i've been saying that i need a duffel bag for a minute because i find that i just need something like a weekender bag where i can just put my stuff in there for a couple days i don't really have to pack a full suitcase so y'all when i saw this i was like in cart period okay like this is so freaking cute it was 60 dollars, so a pretty good price y'all it's huge okay and then if you get up close on it it has like steve matt like sm 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 the steve madden print in different colors y'all this is such a nice bag this is something that i will have forever and i love pops of color y'all i said i was telling my sister whenever i move um my decor scheme will still be like the base of my decor scheme will still be neutral but i definitely want to pop some color into my decor because i do love color so y'all i love that bag so cute and then i picked up this peanuts charlie brown like cookie container so that if I make cookies and stuff, I can take it with me to work or I can take it with me, you know, over family's house and things like that. And then I picked up these glitter markers that I thought would be super cute. I bought two notebooks this weekend so I can start like organizing and planning into next year. So I thought these were so cute so I can, you know, make my little planner look really cute with the markers. I picked up this Ray Dunn tin lid set. So this is for the holidays. So if people want to take little desserts and cookies with them, they can. Um, my sister picked this up at Home Goods, and she was like, "Hannah, when I saw this, I knew you would love it." And y'all, she was not. Y'all know I love me some home decor. I love me some kitchen decor. I have a pro. Like I'm not kidding y'all. I have a problem. Like I don't know. I don't know. Like when I go into grocery stores, I'm just like every time I'm just like, oh my gosh. Like I love being here. Like I have a problem, y'all. Anything food, kitchen decor, kitchenware, serveware. Your girl is there for it. Okay. So when she picked this up, I was like yes this is so cute it was only $20 $19.99 this is a nice heavy serveware dish y'all this is perfect for pastas and things like that like if I did like a large um like pasta dish or like a large batch of like shrimp and grits or something like that you can just set it on the table and everyone can kind of dip in y'all this is such a nice piece I was telling my sister that I want to start doing um 
Sunday dinner family nights, like every other Sunday, have everybody over for dinner. Like you don't have to stay. You can just get some food and go. You can stay. But I just want to start cooking like every other Sunday for family. So this will be put to good use. So I'm so excited for that piece. The next thing that I got is this cup. Y'all, this is so pretty. Like, do y'all see that? That is so, so pretty. My sister and I have a thing for like collecting really cute mugs and I just had to pick this up. I have never seen a mug like this. This is so cute. I'm not, I guess, the biggest fan of The Nightmare Before Christmas. I've watched it a couple times and it's all right. Like it's not something that I would rave about, but this cup, honey, I had to get it. So cute. So I picked that up. When we went to the Apple Orchard, I did pick up some more of these donuts. Y'all know last year I was raving about them. They are so good. You can actually find them on Etsy as well. They're apple cider donuts, y'all. These are such a vibe for fall. So I will put the link to the Etsy shop, their Etsy shop, down in the description box. So if y'all want a little taste of fall and you can't get over to the apple orchard, I'll put that link down below so that y'all can copy off some donuts. I would suggest getting two packages because y'all, they are so good and they go fast. So I'll probably take these with me to work tomorrow because I'm not gonna eat, I don't need to eat all those donuts and I'm not gonna eat all of those donuts by myself. So I'll probably take that with me to work tomorrow. But y'all, it's such a bop. They are so, so delicious. And it's like the perfect donut to have like in the morning with coffee, that type of vibe, not too sweet. So yeah, y'all, I picked that up and then I picked up my 2021, 2022 planner. I love this one because it has the like spiral ring. The last one I got last year was just like an open and close and I didn't like that because I couldn't lay it all the way flat and I find that I like laying my pages flat so I can write properly on both sides. So yeah I picked this up so I'm gonna start using this. I'm gonna um, go ahead and put my old one away like transfer all my birthdays and important dates to this one and go ahead and start using her and like I told y'all um, I did get my markers and stuff so I can make everything super cute because I like to plan ahead and there's a lot of things that I want to start doing um, like for the admin collective getting that back going and for like content in my channel in general and then I picked up <laughs> some more kitchenware a cookie cooling rack for cookies this season and then I picked up this really cute piece for my bathroom this is gonna go on top of my bathroom sink counter and it's gonna hold the hand soap my candle and little little knickknack stuff y'all but this is like the perfect size and the wood finish and the white on the inside will match the color scheme in my bathroom really well so that's what I picked up from home that's just from home goods y'all and then we went to TJ Maxx I think I showed y'all this in the video I got another one of the like makeup headbands so you can like hold your hair back while you're washing your face and doing your makeup. I got a blender bottle because like I told y'all, I'm gonna get back on my healthy eating, all that kind of stuff. So I got a blender bottle so I can make like protein shakes in the morning and stuff like that. Um, I got these scented pins which I thought were really cute. I'm trying to build up my pin collection, y'all, like my aesthetic pin collection. So I got that. And then I picked up this notebook. Once again, this is gonna hold me through 2020, the rest of this year and next year. So I thought that was super cute. I did pick up a couple candles as well. So this is the first one I picked up. It's called Heritage Pumpkin by DW Home. My sister picked this one up because of the packaging. She was like, oh, this will match your decor really nicely. And it does. And I feel like this is something I can use even after the wax is melted because it's just a really nice container. So you can put stuff in here. So let me smell it. Mm, it smells so good. Mm, it's like a light pumpkin scent, not too heavy, but this is a perfect fall scent. I love this one. So definitely check that one out if y'all can find it. And then I also picked up this one. Y'all, I thought the packaging on this one was so freaking cute. It's like a little cup. I wonder if I could actually use it as a cup once I finish. I probably could, huh, y'all? But this one is Warm Apple Cider, also from DW Home. Mmm. It's like a nice light 
apple scent y'all this one smells so good as well so if you guys get your hands on either one of these scents pick it up for fall because these are such a vibe and like i said this is something even after the wax is melted i can use as like christmas decor so i thought that was so cute and then the next items are just clothing items y'all i could not believe how many tops i found at tj maxx y'all know i tell y'all all the time my issue with my wardrobe are my blouses and my tops like it's not hard to find them but just hard to find i guess the look that i'm going for and these are tops that i can wear with leggings and boots i can wear these with jeans and slip-on shoes so i picked up this one just a long sleeve camo and y'all see how it's like longer in the back so you can wear this with leggings to cover your butt but it's a really cute simple sweater so i picked that up i picked up this one it's like a like a gray blue color again long in the back simple nice light material this one has a hood on it has like a little distressed look to it so i got that i did get some loungewear as well so i got this little set it's like the little lounge pants with the black shirt to go with it so i picked that up super cute and then i picked up y'all i don't own a shorts pajama set like i don't know why i have never gotten my hands on one of these but i picked this one up it's just like the top and that's what the print looks like just polka dot the top and then the shorts to go with it so i thought that was super cute to wear around the house and then i picked up another light sweater for fall just this burgundy long sweater has like a ribbed detailing on it super simple scoop neck love it i'm trying to simplify my wardrobe get pieces that will last me forever that i can dress up or down so that's the vibe i was going for y'all and then i picked up another scoop neck sweater this is just a plain black one long love it <laughs> and then i picked up this two pack of like loungewear pants to wear around the house and it has like the cuffed detailing at the bottom and you get a two pack one black one gray and these are like that nice light jersey material i love it because i get hot easily i'm very hot nature so i like this like jersey material this light stretchy jersey material because i feel like it cools me down and keeps me cool around the house so that's perfect if i'm like cleaning and doing little stuff around the house running errands so yeah but yeah you guys that is all i got I'm about to put all this stuff up. I need to edit, finish editing the budget video to go up tomorrow. It was supposed to go up today, but I'm going to finish editing that tonight to go up tomorrow. Put this stuff away and get in the bed, get ready for work. Thank you guys so much for watching. I know this vlog was all over the place. I tried to remember to pick up the camera as much as possible, but y'all, I be forgetting. But I hope that you guys enjoyed the vlog. I will leave all the information to the Apple Orchard, the Etsy shop, any links that I can find for you guys. And yeah, don't forget to leave me a comment down below. Like the video, share the video with your friends and family, and I will see you guys in the next one.